Hello, I'm Tara Matthews from South Africa, and I would like to share my praise report with you today. Title, A Desperate Cry Out for Help. Today's promise, and do not forget to do good and to share with others. With such sacrifices, God is pleased. Hebrews 13, verse 16. Hello, brides. Today, I just want to share a praise of how my husband always provides. My son was blessed with some clothing and school clothing from my earthly husband, Dale's colleague. A month or so later, there was a message on my son's school WhatsApp group from one of the other mommies that said her daughter's school jacket went missing and she could not find it. This happened in the middle of winter, so mornings are quite cold and kids need a jersey or jacket at least. Reading between the lines, I could hear that it was a desperate cry out for help. I spoke to my love because I had an extra jacket for my son. I could hear he wanted me to bless this little girl. And knowing his word, I knew I could not withhold and that I needed to give. So I blessed this little girl with the extra school jacket. A month or two later, my son loses his jacket. I went to school, checked lost and found, and it was not found. My husband still provides because the school uniform shop blessed my son with a second-hand school jersey. This is where my praise gets really, really good. A few months later, Dell's colleague blesses us again. But this time, he gives only school things and lots of it. White school t-shirts, B-school jacket, jackets, jacksuit pants, PT shorts, socks. When we give, we truly do receive, pressed down, shaken together and running over. Isn't he just so good to us? After my son lost his jersey, I did question myself and I did have the thought of maybe I should not have given it. But after the blessings of receiving all those school items, I knew I did the right thing by giving. I'm really thankful for the opportunity he gave me to learn such an important lesson regarding the principle of giving. Don't doubt when you have the opportunity to give. See it as an opportunity to see how he will bless you double or even triple. Give and it will be given to you. They will pour into your lap of good measure. Press down, shaken together and running over with no space, space left for more. For with the standard of measurement you use when you do good to others, it will be measured to you in return. Luke 6 verse 38. And do not forget to do good and to share with others. For with such sacrifices God is pleased. Hebrews 13 verse 16. Freely you have received, freely give. Matthew 10 verse 8. There are many scriptures in God's word that speaks about giving. If we find it hard to give, we need to ask him to help us because his word says that he loves a cheerful giver.